Now I'm going to show you a delicious ceviche recipe now. Um, very, very simple to make. The most important thing in the whole recipe is the freshness of the fish. We'll get to the fish in a second, but first off, a little bit of tomato puree, a little bit of orange juice, and we're just making a sort of a little liquor here, like kind of a light dressing that'll bring the whole mixture together. We're also going to squeeze in a little bit of fresh lime juice. Now I'm always generous with the lime juice because I'm a big fan of that sort of nice zesty way that it cuts through the fish. So add in as much as you feel comfortable with. Now bring that together into a sort of a smooth little liquid. We're also going to add in some olives. I'm using olives that are stuffed with pimentos today. You could use plain olives, black olives, whatever you feel comfortable with. Just make sure to remove the pips. I also added in a little bit of diced chili. Just remove the seeds from the chili and dice it into little slithers. Now, next in, we're going to add in a little bit of sliced uh, green pepper. You could use sliced red pepper, but the green pepper, I've just removed the membrane from the middle, sliced it up nice and thin, and that's going to give the ceviche a really sort of crunchy, nice, flavoursome texture. Now, your tomato. Very important to remove that little core out of there. And we're just going to get a rough dice of tomato. Now the tomato again is going to add that sort of lovely moisture to the ceviche. And it's all about sort of textures. You've got the soft tomato, the really soft fish. In there you're going to have the crunchy uh, peppers, the nice crunch of the onion. And it'll be like a real sort of explosion of flavours in your mouth. Now, in goes the red onion. We're also going to add in some of our lovely chopped herbs. And the fish, so, so important that it's fresh. Go down to your local fishmongers. It has to be caught that morning at the very, very latest, the day before, but you really don't want to make this dish with fish that's been sitting around for a couple of days. It's all about the freshness. And our lovely chopped herbs in there, and we're just going to combine the whole mixture up. It's the perfect sort of dish that you could eat on a summer's day. A little glass of chilled white wine out on the terrace. Really, really, absolutely a light, healthy snack. Super delicious and really nicely served with just a simple sort of slice of uh, bread, another little squeeze of lime juice, just taste it as you go along, look for that sort of perfect flavour, finish it off with a little bit of oil to combine the whole mixture, and what you're going to end up with is an absolutely gorgeous ceviche.